Hey everybody, let's check in with the horses that are in rehab at Gentle Spirit Horses this week. It's been quite the morning this morning as I'm getting ready to do rehab roundup. These ducks will not leave me alone. They're following me everywhere, so I figured they could say hi. <laughs> Cinna is on stall rest after surgery on his leg to remove some scar tissue from an old unhealed wound. He wants to be right in my face. It's hard to video him. He's doing great. Stitches are out. He's recovering nicely. He will just remain on stall rest for the next few months as it heals together. Benny remains on rehab for ongoing lameness. While we were showing some improvement, he did uh, go on safari with some friends. This little guy could open gates um, and pulled, seemed to scrape and or re-injure his back leg. So he's a little lame. We've been doing sweat wraps and watching it. But again, he has plenty of time to heal. We're more and more convinced that his soreness comes from a tendon injury rather than navicular. So we're very, we're relatively optimistic that he will have a good future and we won't be facing anything horrible this spring. All right, Benny, there's a glimpse at Rocky who was on rehab for weight loss not that long ago, but he's looking great as well. Air Force here is in because of a puncture wound to his shoulder. It's healing slowly. He does have Cushing's, which makes him heal slower. He is also blind, um, but he's doing very well. He is uh, enjoying his stall rest and just being a good boy. Uh, I would suspect maybe a week or two more, he's still on antibiotics. So he just remains on rehab until, until he's healed. Princess Di here decided to break out of her stall last night and <laughs> catch herself on the latch and hurt her shoulder. She is a 28 year old Shetland pony. It's always the old farts, I swear. So she is in for a couple days while we watch it for healing and started antibiotics. Navy and Violet. Hi, Vi. Everybody's doing really well. Recovering from the storm. These two are both looking for homes, aren't you? Yeah. Nice sweet girls. Lucy's here in pasture. She's here because she's had some aggression and some anxiety issues. Kind of keeping an eye on her. I mean, we've seen great improvement in her trust and her love, but I don't kind of surprised she's letting me get this close while she's lying down. I want to make sure she's she gets back on her feet pretty soon and eats and that we're not dealing with a colicky issue. But otherwise, her behavior has greatly improved. She's looking really good at coming into training this spring and we're pretty happy with her. Hopefully she's uh, just resting. Also lying down this morning is Cody, our other horse who is on rehab for behavior. He's come a long ways, and like I said, once we once we feel like he is safe to work with, he'll be released for adoption. And we do have he does have a pending adoption with a volunteer who has worked with him extensively, so he's in good shape. I hate cliffhangers. I thought I'd let you know that Lucy did get up when I asked her to and is eating, so probably is not colicky and was just sleepy. Again, good sign for being ready for training this year. That she would trust me enough to come that close while she's sleeping. I'll keep an eye on her, make sure she's okay. And that wraps up this week's look at the horses in rehabilitation at Gentle Spirit Horses Rescue. Please be sure to like and subscribe to continue to see our updates and watch for